All right, friends, from soups to mocktails, new viral recipes, you probably see them up on social media. Uh, do they really boost immunity and help you sleep? The mindful nutritionist Jackie Kirshen is here to explain. I see everybody say, oh, I saw that on social media, it told me to do it, so I'm going to do it. You're going to walk us through some of these trends and tell us if they really work? Yeah, I'm going to do some myth busting. Okay. There are some good things behind it, but most of them, yes, are trends. They're trends. Take us through, first of all, what is in that pot? So this is the hottest like swamp soup, which is, again, doesn't sound very appetizing based off of the name, but it does have some really good ingredients, like it would have some raw garlic, it would have some ginger, some jalapeno, spinach. It's called the swamp soup? Yeah, so it looks very swampy, so the color is like eh, but it actually is apparently very delicious. Okay. But people swear that it is like getting a flu shot, but I mean, it's essentially Ooh. just giving you vitamins and minerals, and if it helps you eat your veggies, I'm all for it. Okay, if that works, it works. Let's do it. What is our next trend? So this is called the Sleepy Girl Mocktail, which went totally viral last year. Okay. So what it is essentially, it is a glass of ice, and then you have some tart cherry juice and then you can take any of your sparkling water. The trend was using a probiotic water, so an expensive way to get bubbly water. Um, but this way, they say that it increases melatonin, tryptophan, serotonin, and helps you sleep. Oh. But it's seriously just a placebo effect. So oh, is it? So this, this is, doesn't work? I mean, it will <laughs> make you think that you're tired. Do you want to try Sure. I, mean, I don't need to be more tired than I am right now, but... So the kicker is that you put in magnesium. I didn't do it for you because I really don't want you falling asleep on no, set. I don't want to fall asleep. So, uh, but the magnesium again promotes more. Again, uh, you know, falling asleep with cel uh, sorry melatonin. Yes. So again, just take the magnesium, I, which is what I usually recommend yes, to my clients. Take the I take magnesium every night. So do I. Yeah. I use okay. Calm. Here we go. Uh, what's this next one? So this is called a medieval dinner. I think. It's something that's like very hilarious because I call them snack plates, like adult Lunchables. It's essentially just taking some of your favorite foods and putting them on a plate. And it's also called Lazy Girl Dinner. So it's essentially just like, I'm not in the mood to cook. I'm gonna get some protein, some veggies, some healthy fats. I'm and put so it on. confused. It, it's this really, was a trend? It's called a trend because it's something that literally we give to our kids, but it's for adults. But oh. I think the cute name of Hot girl dinner or girl dinner in medieval. Dinner. Yeah, <laughs> girl dinner, exactly. Girl dinner. So it's very easy to make. Okay, all right. But, but dietitian approved. Dietitian approved. Look at all that yes. stuff. That stuff is good for you. Okay, what do we have next? Okay, so this is actually one of my favorite ones. This is the viral cottage cheese ice cream. Oh boy. I am all for it. Any way that you can reduce added sugar and also add protein, it's super, super simple. You essentially take your uh, cottage cheese, again, you can get low fat, you can get full fat, and then you add some honey for some sweetness. I got a little creative and fancy. I added some peanut butter and chocolate chips. So for those of you that can't have dairy, please don't have this find a dairy-free option, um, but you can absolutely have this as a great, healthy way to enjoy a cold treat. Oh, oh, <laughs> okay. Tell me if that cottage cheese ice cream is really good. Let's see. Or this is one of those things on social media, they just kind of like fake it. And go, so it won't be Ben and Jerry's, but... <laughs> Oh, no, 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 you're doing that. You're doing that for the crowd. I didn't invent it, so I'm not taking credit for it. <laughs> oh, that's exactly why these are like, did he run? Yeah. This is why they're trends and they may not work. I mean, it's not ice cream. Let's not, be real. Okay, it's not ice it's cream. Not, uh, you just dropped the episodes of the Mindful Nutritionist podcast. I can't believe you ran off. Uh, what, what do you hear in that? Um, so again, it's all about sustainable weight loss tips and healthy mindset, motherhood, entrepreneurship. So if you want to hear more trend busting <laughs> and real sustainable weight loss tips, then definitely listen to the Mindful Nutritionist Show. Foxysandiego.com. Click the little seat on tab if you want to get hooked up and uh, look or listen to the podcast. Are you okay? Are you, you okay? okay? <laughs> it's just cottage cheese. It's so much better for you. I'm probably going to try that in commercial break too. I want to see if it's right. Give me my drink back. We'll be right back. <laughs> That's mine. Don't touch it.